What is going on guys, it's Madmine back with another video and today we finally have the power of expansion. I'm going to be going over my team, the power of expansion and other stuff so you can use a power up pass or training. We are using Taylor Maze with training, obviously. He doesn't get any other card art, that's okay. Uh, he's in our sub linebacker, he's going to be our user. We don't have full sprinter and everything maxed out but it'll be 99 speed, 98 excel at 6'3". 99 tackle, he'll probably, I'm using run stuff actually because he's my user. So he's he has 86 block shed. He's probably gonna have he's gonna have 80 90 block shed once I get full um full run stuff on him. Uh 99 hit power, 99 tackle. That is why this card is so good. Great impact block, good COD. Um we're gonna go over the team though. Taylor, Taylor Mays, he is a gold 99 at sub linebacker, but they are all 98 overalls, which kind of does suck. But we're going over the team right now. Uh, we'll maybe make some upgrades. As of right now, this is what it's looking like. I'll show you guys the defense first. Uh, right now, we have 27 Steelers. Uh, we have nothing maxed out. We're kind of in the process of building it. We're going to be building it over the next couple of days when prices go down for Ultimate Legends. Friday for Golden Tickets and stuff. But this is what it's looking like right now. So we still have Justin Reed, Derek Roberson, Sam Mills, still obviously LT, Jadavion Clowney, Eric Berry's Nat, Cam Chancellor I have back here now. He will be playing underneath for me now. We have Ramsey, Mike Evans. Still don't know who to go for my third corner. I'm going to be powering up Minjo. This is what the D-line is looking like, though. Then the offense where everything is going on. This is what the offense is looking like as of right now. Mike Vick, we have a skateboardist gunslinger hot run master on him. Again, I'm not going to show stats because chems aren't really maxed out. We have Drew Brees right here uh, for just like he gets times for chems, and he was pretty much free. Uh, Jerome Bettis with tank and freight train. Then we have double edge protectors. Uh, right now, you guys see we don't have any receivers. We um, have Kyle Pitts still. He's great. Dre Archer, Najee Harris. Uh, our running backs are stacked now. Derek Watt back here as well. So pretty much we're just building up the team, really just waiting um, for prices and stuff. I wanna. I wish they said who else got it somehow. Is there a way we can see in the store or something? No. Um, I'm going to go check Twitter, I guess, really quick, and see if we, oh, I'll check Instagram first. Um, so we have Saquon, Roddy White, OC, I think, is there just four? There might just be four right now. But uh, I'm just going to be looking for some cards in this video, to be completely honest. I know I want Delpit. Um, again, great end game card. Three thirty though, I'll pass on that. Not a bad price. Um, but I saw him at like two or three hundred like the other day. Receivers, I have zero idea what I want to do with receivers. Honestly, I might go Jalen Waddle honestly because he looks good. But at the same time, like I could get Jalen Rieger. Again, don't really know. I could also go A B honestly, but I don't know if I want to go A B. He'd get 99 speed, obviously, and stuff, and his stats are good. But I'm looking this for this guy would be my outside guy, these deep threats that can just get separation. I don't know if AB is the guy to get separation. In the inside, I also really don't know who I want to go. That's why I'm kind of undecided on my receivers at this moment. Um, I was honestly thinking I do want this Cordero Patterson, but he's just so expensive. So I don't really want to. Um... Oh, they just tweeted it. Okay, so uh, okay, so Phil Lo 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 Load Holt, Drew Bennett got one, Logan Thomas, Max Strong, Saquon Roddy White, and the defense OC Taylor Mays, Devin McCourty, Michael Brockers, Takeo Spikes, and Frank Frank Minifield. I think that's how you say it. Logan Thomas, really. First of all, I actually want to see what I have Drew Bennett on my bench right now. Um, so we are going to go look at his speed because that, that card is disgustingly good um, because his height and everything. So we have Drew Bennett here. Where is his? There it is. All right. If we go all the way up, he will have, what is that, 88. Oh, wait, 88. I'm stupid. I can't do math. Plus 6. 94. Oh, that's really bad, actually. So he's completely unusable in the game. Um, Logan Thomas. Do I have a Logan Thomas? Logan Thomas might become one of the best tight ends in the game, honestly. 
I don't. We will go look for his power up really quick because I might actually want to use that as my second uh, tight end. <laughs> but let's let's check Logan Thomas out, and then let's check out Minifield or whatever. Yeah, let's check out what is it Minifield? Yeah. Uh, well, I I definitely have a Minifield power up 100%. But Logan Thomas again, what's his speed gonna be? He's not he's not slow. So if they give him good speed, he's not a bad card, in my opinion. And he will be at ninety-two speed to ninety-four speed with ninety-six Excel. So just like every other tight end, nothing really special. But he will have ninety COD. He's gonna have seventy-nine run block power. What's his run block? Normal run block. Where is that? Run block will be twelve. Uh, what is that? It would be 83, so not bad. His pass block is also going to be 80, which isn't bad. Uh, 95 catching. 92 carry isn't bad either. Good agility. Um, What's his height again? 6'6". Six, six. Actually, that's not bad. And then Minifield or whoever we're going to go check out really quickly. We also do have Saquon. I'm not going to pick Saquon up. I just got Jerome Bettis, so... That's an end game running back. We also do have that Minka there that we're not going to be using. We're going to try to sell. I definitely have a Minna, Minna Field power up. I thought. Jason McCordy, I think they said, also got one. Oh, apparently I don't. Well, that's unfortunate. Let's look at Jason McCordy, though. Oh, never mind. Not Jason. It was the other one, the Patriots one. So that's fine. Um, Minna Field, we don't have. We'll go buy him, too. Because I think he's going to be a more physical corner, right? Now, obviously, these power up expansions, um, I don't know if they're like... They're not the greatest cards in the game, right? They're just giving people cards. Okay, so he's dirt cheap, so that's cool. Um, they're just giving cards, like people cards that they don't really have either time to make cards for, like Ultimate Legends, or that just don't have a promo for them, if that makes sense. But let's check here, because this guy, what is he? He's big, I think. So he's going to have 95 speed. Slow. Too slow. Oh, never mind. He's tiny. So that card's completely useless. Um, so really the only one that is actually good is Taylor Mays. Because you don't need... you like Because Takeo Spikes, you, the middle linebackers are useless. Devin McCourty will have good zone, but again, there's way better free safeties. And then Brockers, I really don't think... I mean, I used Brockers last year, not going to lie, because his block shed was just stupidly high. So we can actually look at this card. I don't actually need a defensive uh, end, because I already have JJ, and I have Vanderbosch, but we can look. Let's see. So up here, what is he going to have? He's going to have 48, 58, 68... 77 speed, really slow. Uh, 80, whoa, though, he's going to have 76, 86, 90, 4 Excel. Uh, he's going to have 98 impact block. He's going to have 50, 60, 70, 86, 95 power move. He's going to have 67 finesse, if I'm right. Where's the block shooting? Does it not show block shooting or am I blind? It doesn't show block shooting. That's actually... Does it here? No. What's the strength going to be? 70, 80, 96 strength. So again, yeah, I think Taylor Mays really is the only usable one, uh, unfortunately, but that's all right. But yeah, again, guys, team's getting switched up. I'm starting to just use cards that I want to use, you know? I still need to sell off this Minka who continues to crash in price them. Which is unfortunate. But I did a set for really cheap with the cards I had in my binder. Uh, what else do I have that I don't really need? This Jim Thorpe I really have no use for. I'm This Travis Kelsey just does not sell. <laughs> He's either 150k, or 120k, or 300k. And no matter what, he doesn't sell. Let me get a couple other guys. But the good thing about this is Titans theme teams, he just went up in price. I spent 7k on this card. So I'm making profit there. I'd say start investing in some of these low team diamonds that uh that aren't getting upgrades because I think like if they haven't gotten a legend already, they're probably not getting an ultimate legend. So guys, really go out and get those in my opinion is what I would recommend for you guys. 
Other than that, there's nothing really new. Again, super busy last week of school. Like, finally. Um, but yeah, so I'm just going to be... I'll just look around a little bit. But nothing new coming to the game at this point. In, like, right now. Like, we got the we got the power-up expansion, which I actually like a lot. Where are golden tickets? Why am I blind? I'm actually excited that we did get it. Um, honestly, Delpit isn't... 3.30. We can... I'm going to check his price really quickly. Just really quickly. He's at 3.75 on Mutthead, and he's 3.30 right now. So, if we look at prices, what does he get to? This is actually cheaper than he's ever been, at, according to Madden. So, maybe we'll go pick him up right now. Uh, he's going to be playing underneath with Bam Bam, of course, because they're both big, like, enormously strong hitting safeties. Um, both 98 speed, but again, that's totally fine. So, let's go here. Ogden, I just started powering up because I'm like, I want him to be gold 99 at least. So, I, his 93 is expensive, though. And, I, again, guys, if you guys want to see a specific corner or something, please let me know. Because I really don't have any, like, direction I'm going with this. Like, if you guys want to see a specific corner, please let me know. He only get browns. What does he have? <laughs> he already has 99 zone. <laughs> he already has 99 attack on the 9 pursuit. So maybe block should would be the... I think run stuff would also be the move on him. <coughs> right? I get catching, though. Maybe I'll just go lock down. Uh, and then I have to put sprinter on him. Honestly, thankfully, these power-up expansion guys aren't all, like, crazy good. I know that sounds, like, kind of stupid, but... Hybrid run support times 2. So this one is run support. So yeah, I'm actually kind of glad that they're not the greatest just because that means I don't have to spend billions of training on them, um, which I'm totally happy with. Is there anything for one AP that's like really good? He gets run stopper. I don't know. I don't really see anything that's like maybe Stonewall. <coughs> we can try that on him. Why not? So we're actually running three deflators now. Cam Chancellor, Delpit, and Enforce Deflator on two. Uh, what's his name? On uh, Taylor Mays, which is cool. So, what else do we need? I mean, we just, yeah, like, I might have a power pass for this. I don't. I don't know who my 93, 94 is on. Because if I look through everybody. 93, 94. Not on offense. 93. Oh, Cam Chancellor. So, um... We can just check that. But yeah, I mean, that's what the team's looking like. Again, we're just kind of building it slowly, deciding what we want to do. Like, I'll show you guys really quickly. Again, I don't want to make this too long. Um, right now, Ogden is really expensive. Not only as 98, but also as 93. So he used to be 250K-ish. I'm going to wait until he gets back down. He's at three. So he is going down. I did sell off Worfs just because... Worf sold. I sold Worfs for 650,000 coins, which was actually absurd. Ogden's 90. That's actually a fine price now. Uh, I'll take that now. Now we're just waiting on his 99. We also have a ton of power passes. I'm still trying to get a David Akers back. He also shot up in price a lot, which does kind of suck. So I'm waiting for him to come down. Like, look at his price. Why are kickers so stu He was like 300 at one point. Um, but again, I don't know what to do for receivers or my third corner, so please let me know if you guys have like any specific thing you guys want to see. I'll definitely do it. I actually don't need to power AB up, though, if I get him, because I do have 25 Steelers. But I don't know if I want to use him. 
But yeah, anyways, guys, just let me know. Uh, secondary tight end, let me know on that. Let me know on um, on the receivers. Let me know on the third corner. I was thinking Stefan Gilmore, but again, so expensive, dude. So I like, I don't know. If you guys like Slay, please let me know Darius Slay. I was thinking about Darius Slay. Um, other than that, nobody really caught my eye, to be completely honest with you guys. So let me know about Darius Slay if you like him. But yeah, other than that, our safeties are filled out. Like, our linebackers are fine. Um, D-line's good. Pretty much core guys are good. So yeah, just let, honestly, just let me know what you guys want to see on the team. This is kind of up to you guys. I'm not super picky. I got the players I want, so it's time to put in guys that you guys would maybe recommend. I think that would be a little bit more fun. Uh, so I'll do this. And then obviously, I'll fill out the backups with a bunch of chem stuff eventually. Uh, does he get the times four here? No, he does not. And I still have a power pass. I have my 99 power pass. Oh, no, I don't. I'm at 98. Sorry. So maybe I actually do throw it on him because I don't have any other. I, all my 98s are nat, I think. He's nat. He's nat. Um, Cam is a 99. He's not really. JJ's not worth anything. So yeah, just let me know. But I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please drop a like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.